The Bethlehem Royal Hospital is over 760 years old and it is the oldest psychiatric hospital in the world still functioning today. For many years we've had Bethlehem Museum and the Bethlehem Gallery both on site in the hospital. But earlier this year, uh, in February, uh, we both moved into this fantastic new building that is enabling us to share the amazing work of artists from South London and Morsey NHS Trust and from beyond. So this is um, one of two drawings in the exhibition by an artist called Albert and Albert was um, a, a really important for me in thinking about this exhibition. Um, I was really interested in the fact that he kind of creates these Sort of worlds within his work. He draws these kind of spaces that when I first saw them I thought they were quite threatening and then I realised they were much more to do with creating kind of safe places. Primarily this was about the artist. So if you look at the history of art there's a the whole range of you know famous sort of icons of art who've had struggles with, me with mental health. So I think that you know I wanted it to be about art, but I also wanted it to show that the, you know, there's a thread of creativity that we artists use and people maybe hit, you know, use in mental health as well to help themselves. This piece was done towards the end of my admission here as a patient. I think what occupational therapy and, um, in this case, art gives the patient is, and certainly gave me, is a sense of power and um, the ability to create for yourself. Um, outside of the strictures of psychiatric care. For people with mild to moderate mental health problems, depression, anxiety, actually being involved in a, um, a visual arts group or a poetry group can actually potentially save the NHS money rather than you know, another prescription for antidepressants. So the, there's a lot of research going on now and I think it's starting to sort of point towards the fact that it is Good value for money. The gallery spaces, it's a real it's a bridging platform to think about mental health, think about their own mental health and think about things from a different perspective.